Hey, Divas and Gents, I'm coming to you with a birthday goodies, or birthday goodies, um, from Miss Tara, who is Nurse Tara 01 here on YouTube. Shame, shame, shame on you. She went above and beyond um, sending me stuff. This was completely unexpected of her. I am. She did say she sent me a card, and I was really excited about the card, mind you. Very excited, because I did not receive any handmade cards this um this year for my birthday, excluding the tag, um, the tag card that Elizabeth made, I haven't received anything. So I was super excited because I love handmade cards. I love it. So um, I was really excited about that. And then she kept telling me, um, when are you going to get home? You know, I don't want them to leave it outside. And then, you know, because people might come by and she was worried about somebody taking it. And I'm thinking, it's a card. They will put that in my mailbox. Nobody's going to take that. We're good, right? And I was like feeling like, okay, she's sounding a little suspect. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. This is why. Because it wasn't a card. It was a box that was in front of my doorstep. <laughs> so, shame on you. But thank you so much. And um, I did record this yesterday. But the battery died. Yeah. So, half of this got open. So, I'm going to show you. <clears throat> excuse me. I'm going to show you the half that I opened and then I'm going to show you this box. I haven't opened this box. I literally closed it when the battery died. I closed it and did not go in it. So this will be brand new. And then this right here, I did. I already seen it, <laughs> but I told her, I called her and I told her I felt bad. So anywho, here is some straws and she shared some of her straws of her you know, collection of them. And I have none of these ones and I have straws, mind you, but I don't have anything with prints except for one that has flowers. Other than that, I don't have like fruits and cakes and polka dots. So this is going to come in handy. Thank you so much for sharing. And then I have all of these in metallics, which I have no metallics except for silver. And I don't know if I have gold. I might have both of these colors but I do not have all of these. So this is super duper cool. I love it. Thank you so much girl for sharing your straws with me. And then here are some pencils and they all have little sayings on them. Think good, think good thoughts. Yes, you can do the impossible. So these are inspirational pencils. This is very, very cool. Thank you so much. Okay. <clears throat> and then she gifted me Illustrated Faith. I have not purchased one thing from Illustrated Faith at all. And um, uh, and it was really nice that she did this because this is, you know, it's you pay for this. And that's probably because there's not a lot of faith-based type crafting stuff. So they're a little more pricier. And I didn't know if I want to venture into this new craft on top of all my other crafts. So... This was really unexpected and this is very, very cool. And I'm so appreciative, girl. Seriously, you did way too much. This is so super sweet and I love it. I cannot wait to do this because I will be getting into some Bible journaling. And this was just a charm. It's not part of the um, Illustrated Faith. So this is a cross charm that I will be using to make for myself. And these right here are bookmarks. So these are super cute. I love these. Now, and also too, you don't have to do the Bible journaling or just art journaling. You can also do these to make cards, you know? So it's it's not just um, doing those if you don't want to. Um, I want to get into the Bible journaling, but I'm afraid because I don't know. My penmanship is horrible. I cannot draw. So when you're decorating a Bible, the last thing you want to do is ruin it, right? Because you can't erase it. You can't rip up the page and crumple it and throw it away. That's horrible. Oh, I would die. I would die. I could not do something like that, not to the Bible. So that's why I never wanted to get into it. And I'm just showing you these. These right here are kind of like, I guess, like bookmarks um, or things for journaling as well to add into your journal book. So... I was like, man, you know, I don't want to do that. But then Tammy um, got into it and we and me and her both were talking about it. And then the concern for both of us was just ruining it. Uh, but she dived in. So I, she's going to be my total inspiration. And I'm hoping that her and I can take some Bible journaling classes or just art journaling just to teach me how to do something because 
uh, <laughs> I just feel like if you're not born with that with that ability to know how to draw or to you know your penmanship I just don't feel like you get it later so I don't know I know my limitations and I feel like that's it but we're gonna give it a whirl so here is some hearts look at some sweet treats polka dots I love this page right here you see all the words in there believe happy faith amen pray love joyful oh my gosh I love that page so I'll definitely be making cards out of this and look at the banners to cut out bright and just fun and the reverse sides are all solid so you have print on one and then solid on the other how stinking cute this is the cutest ever i love the tickets because they have all little sayings as well i love it and then i think it just duplicates again so thank you so much for these oh my gosh tara you seriously did way too much like way too much and then she got me some of these stickers that are sunflowers my favorite flower so it was very thoughtful of her to send me these i love jolie's stickers they are always the cutest and that's because most of the time they're dimensional and then she got me this love it i do not have but a couple things from costa rica and um i'm costa rican just so you know <laughs> And so it's very tough to find stuff that says Costa Rica or anything on it. Um, I'm in California, so I cannot find anything like that. So it's really cool when um, I run across stuff like this, which is not often. So thank you so much, girl, for picking this up for me. I appreciate it. I will totally be using that for something for me. And then here is a shaker rosette. And these right here, I want you to look at this because I'm going to put Tara on blast right now. She has never done rosette wands. This is her first time making it. And I need you to look for some flaws because I'm trying to look for some, for real. Like I'm really trying to look to see where it's a hot mess. And mm, yeah, I'm kind of feeling like, I don't know, she might be lying or something. <laughs> Do you see how stinking cute this is? Like seriously, look at how stinking cute. I absolutely love it. Look at how bright and fun shaker came out perfect she made this rosette by hand and then she put stickles all along the edge super duper cute thank you so much this is really super pretty girl and i don't have any rosette wands that were gifted to me except for my swap with bridget so these will be going in that same jar with hers because it's everything is bright and fun super duper cute and here's another one and then she used some like that tutu trim. This is the Tim Holtz rosette. Then she has a really pretty die cut here. She puts some sticker bling. And this one sits a little higher, this little pocket. But look at all the yumminess. And she is a fan of these bows. Let me tell you, all the ones I have, it was from her gifting me these. Super cute. And I love that she used this curly ribbon. A lot of you girls do that and I've yet to do it. And I really do dig the look. I might have to just jump on that bandwagon super cute thank you so much girl these are extra kind of amazing super pretty and mind you everything came wrapped really beautifully okay unfortunately like i said my camera died and then look at these tassels i was dying when she sent these i'm like what now that girl is a straight stalker on some aliexpress she finds stuff that you're like what i didn't know they had that she does she gets some really cool unique things from there and i love it i've never seen these super cute and they're not really lightweight they're beautiful she altered that little clip just gorgeous love love these thank you so much she made a couple of these clips gorgeous perfect for the planner and then this is um, a bottle opener, lid thingy opener, and it's heavy. It's like a paperweight, and it's a pineapple. It's super pretty. Love that. I have to keep that for events that take place in my home. And then these super cute napkins. I've seen these before. They're really adorable. Love them. And then she got me these really pretty stamps that i'm super excited i've always wanted these but they're pricey and i can't seem to do it because i wanted to get the dies for these as well but i was like mm, no it's not a necessity i don't feel like i got to have it 
but I was really happy she got these. So thank you so much, girl. I mean, seriously, this is a lot. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love this. Now let's get into this. What? Oops, this wasn't attached to the box. This was on the packaging, so I kept that. Do you see this? We have a swap coming up at the end of next month. And uh, yeah, we're doing one of these swaps. So I'm like totally scoring off of the fact that she just made me this one. So how fabulous is this? And then here is the back. So you see right there, she got her little fancy stamp and it's just gorgeous. And she spray painted this box. Um, or she used the Martha Stewart um, shimmer. It's one of those two. But do you see how stinking pretty this is? Look at this banner. You have to tell me where you got this banner from, girl. This is an absolute must. Oh my gosh. I love it. And then look at this. So pretty. And she, but look at that. Even to the presents. Little tiny. And they're probably Swarovskis. Super cute. Girl, I can't believe she busted into this. Now I know I'm loved. Right there. <laughs> I've yet to cut into mine. I refuse. <laughs> so, oh my goodness. Are we dying? Look at this lid. Let me see if I can put this a little higher. Let's do that. How stinking cute is that? Oh, this paper is so amazing. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, so here is the card. Yay! <laughs> Yay, yay, yay. <laughs> she is the shaker card queen. I have tutorials by her of all of these things that I need to do. Look at this little rosette. I love it. It's the Tim Holtz one. Everything's so bright. I mean, it makes me happy. My heart is like happy. I love it. Just gorgeous. I love it, love it, love it. And then look at how cute. Wishing you a magical day. And of course, I think she used her, those mar those zig markers, zig, whatever it's called. And then she put some stickles and then a little saying right here. Thank you so much, girl. Thank you, thank you. I did have a great birthday. Thank you. And my birthday's still going. What? <laughs> I still got gifts. My birthday was Sunday. Gorgeous card. Thank you, thank you. I absolutely love it. Ooh wee, I am so excited. I saw her video where she was showing these and um, about the packaging on how to do really cute packaging and stuff like that of the washi. I'm not taking this out. Um, even though she did at the bottom, I'm just gonna leave it in there because they're unicorn washies. So these are super cute and I know she got these from Allie. Super duper adorable. Oh my gosh, I love it. And then there's her coloring super cute i'm so glad i totally watched this video <laughs> oh look at these she made a butt ton of these a butt ton she sent me some pictures and oh my gosh she had like bins of these like she went nuts look at how pretty and fun these are see now i don't have to make my own i love it <laughs> thank you so much girl and she did the ones to layer that is what i'm talking about and i have this die uh this tim holtz one that does the these two so thank you, girl, for doing the work for me. Super cute. And everything's already all sparkled. She did stickles all over everything. And then, oh my gosh. These are charms. It has my granddaughter's name on it. It says Serenity. What in the world? And look at how stinking cute. Girl, yeah, I love the coloring. I love how bright they are. And you embossed this. That is so super cute. And then, oh my gosh, see? I totally dig this. How stinking adorable these dies are. I love it. Oh my gosh, girl. This is so extra. Thank you so much. Look at the packaging. This is gorgeous. And thank you for the dies. Thank you so much. I love it. I cannot wait to give those a whirl. Look at how cute this is. Really? Really? Look at the shaker little yumminess right here. I love it. Laura made me one for my birthday as well in all the yellows. Now I have one that matches this paper line. Love it. She only has a plethora of sequins. So this is super duper cute how she did this packaging. So let's go ahead and open this up. Look at how cute this is. I feel like I got to have that die. Oops, I just popped off the clip. It was a unicorn clip. It's a doodle bug, I bet you. I think it was. 
And look at how she did this. All professional status. Whatever. Show off. <laughs> that is extra stinking cute. When you get stuff like this, you're like, no, you know what? I'm not going to open this like ever. It's just going to sit and look pretty. <laughs> and then she showed this. Oh my goodness, girl. Do you see how spoiled I got? Like for real. This is so extra. I cannot take this out of its packaging. This is gorgeous. Thank you so much. You're a gem. I love that die. And then look at this right here. Some more bling. Look at the packaging. Say what? Everything's better with a little bling. Girl, you have never lied. <laughs> so fabulous. And then she said to open this last. Okay. And it's all wrapped all special. Let me tell you, anybody ever gets anything from me, there will be no wrapping like ever. I super suck at gift wrapping. If I can't put it in a box or a bag, well, then I guess you're not getting a gift. <laughs> Look at her wrapping. Are you kidding? This is so extra stinking cute. Oh, we, I love that heart. Okay, so let's open this up because I don't open anything all super nice. And oh my gosh, why do I recognize that box? Why do I knew it? <laughs> you dirty girl. <laughs> she asked me a while ago, and um, I love Alex and Ani. My friend Bridget got me started on them. She gifted these like every like birthday and Christmas. She was getting to build my stack. So, oh my gosh, are you kidding? Curl too much. <gasps> oh my gosh. O-M to the stinking G. Look at this. I have never seen one with a unicorn on it. Are you pooping me? Okay, that is kind of extra. Uh, extra stinking cute. Oh my gosh, I love it. I'm so adding this to my stack. I'm so adding it to my stack. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so extra. Girl, thank you so much. You know I got mad love for you. Super big hugs from over here. And uh, Callie, all the way to you up in the East Coast. Girl, thank you so much for doing so much for me. Seriously, I, for, I am just beside myself with how amazing my crafty friends are. I am so blessed. Always so blessed. Thank you so much for listening to my rambling and looking at all my amazingness. I'm so excited. <laughs> I can't wait to start touching everything. But thank you, and I will see you guys very soon. Bye!